Hello there, everyone, and we thank you for joining us for the Matt's Weather Weekly Weather News. Today is Wednesday, November 21st, 2012, the day before Thanksgiving. And your quote for today, I hear and I forget. I see and I remember. I do and I understand. Uh, that quote today from Confucius. Okay, what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be reading an article from November half, 30 days from the 1902 Farmer's Almanac. Okay, so from November half, 30 days from the 1902 Farmer's Almanac. This is the first time we're reading anything from the 1902 Farmer's Almanac. The feed in the pastures loses its freshness and fails to keep the animals in as good condition as does the June grass. Consequently, the farmer is obliged to feed them at the barn morning and night. Some to save hay, turn their cows into the mowing fields during this month. This is poor policy because the value thus obtained is much less than the loss sustained by the feeding by feeding the grass close just before winter begins leaving the roots unprotected and exposed to the sudden changes of the weather. The same is also true of pasture lands. Trim grape vines in the autumn after the leaves have fallen. Late turnips should be gathered and corn husks before the cold weather comes. All fruits and vegetables should be stored where there is no danger of frost reaching them. A few hours spent in protecting water pipes and pumps will save much time and expense and prevent being out of water at a season when it will be a great inconvenience to have a supply cut off. So some interesting information from the 1902 Farmers Almanac there. Uh, and now, your WFSB Channel 3 Early Morning 7-Day Forecast. Tomorrow, Thursday, November 22nd, Thanksgiving Day in the United States here. Areas of low clouds and fog possible in the morning, the mostly sunny and pleasant. High 56 degrees inland, 55 at the shore. So pretty good weather for Turkey Day tomorrow. Friday, partly sunny and mild for November. High 56 degrees inland, 55 at the shore. Saturday, partly and mostly cloudy with rain with a few rain and wet snow showers, becoming windy and chilly. High 48 degrees inland, 50 at the shore. Sunday, mostly sunny, blustery, and cold. High 40 degrees inland, 44 at the shore. Monday, partly sunny and breezy. High 46 degrees inland, 48 at the shore. Tuesday, mostly cloudy with rain and wet snow developing. High 44 degrees inland, 48 at the shore. And next Wednesday, November 28th, a wintry mix of rain, sleet, and snow. High 40 degrees inland, 45 at the shore. So right now, for next Wednesday, we are looking at a little bit of a wintry mix developing. However, it's hard to tell exactly what that's going to consist of now because that's a whole seven days away. Um, obviously, we will keep an eye on that for you. And if this turns into any major snow event, we will let you know as we get closer to that day next Wednesday next week. Um, okay, and that'll do it for the Matt's Weather Weekly Weather News this week. There is no guest viewer segment at all this week. Um, and that's it. That's it for the weather news this week. We hope you have a fabulous Thanksgiving. We have a lot to be thankful for this year. And um, that'll do it. We hope you join us next week for the Matt's Weather Weekly Weather News on Wednesday, November 28th. And again, if this uh, wintry mix that we're looking at for next Wednesday materializes into anything, any you know considerable storm, we will keep you updated on that and we will watch that for you as we get closer to that date. That'll be all. We'll see you next week.